All right, we got a nice Ford F-250 in today to do some undercoating work on with our wool wax style coating. This truck here, the guy, customer had new front fenders put on it. A new box from, from another vehicle or this one repaired, I forget what she said. You can tell it's all, all new, it looks great. The cab corners, the bottom of the rockers were done. Had a lot of rocker work done. You can just, there's telltale stuff. You can see it was done before. It's been patched here and, and fixed up and the guy spent a ton of money having this fixed. One of the things that they also did the body shop for him was they went ahead and sprayed it with a hard coating. This is why we absolutely are totally against hard coatings like this style rubbery stuff, or I don't want to mention any brand names here and get into that battle type of thing. But for example, if you see this truck right here, as I'm picking at this, that is actually rust underneath and there's mud underneath this coating. What's going to happen with this coating is it's going to flake around all the edges everywhere, as you can see as it's doing here and it's going to, there you have it. It's already trapping moisture behind it. What a complete disaster. So this coating on this truck is almost like a death sentence. Once you get moisture behind there and road salt, it's gonna destroy this truck. So the only thing I can do at this point is go around and try and descale most of this off. This is absolutely horrible what they did to this truck. I would be so pissed off if I owned this truck right now because they did this, because this stuff is gonna trap the moisture. At this point, I don't know. I'm gonna go ahead and use the wool wax on the body cavities, on the bottom of the box and stuff. But I think I'm gonna give this guy a call and see about what could we do with this. You can see the shackles are all full of it. It's just full of this hard coating that they used to doll up the frame. I, I know what this coating is, but I'm not gonna babble about the brand name, but it's a very nice truck. Excellent out here. But I guess I'm gonna get on this with the descaler tool and see what I can do to loosen some of this up and knock some of this off because it's gonna cause problems. It's gonna cause big problems. This will do, oh, man. This is what you don't wanna do, folks. Stay away from those big chain stores that spray this stuff on. It's, it's liquid death, we call it. The whole truck is gonna come off. And this was just done. I mean, literally just done. Oh my God. All right, I gotta make a phone call on this one and see what this guy wants to do because this is gonna be horrible.